Today I'll be showing you how to make this super cute Rice Krispie Donut. I got this recipe from the Primrose Bakery Celebrations book, which I was kindly sent by the book people. You can check out their YouTube channel here, and I'll link their website below. To start, spray your pan with some release spray and leave it on the side until later. This will help the Rice Krispie treats come right out. Put the butter into the pan over a low heat and let that melt. Once it's melted, add all of your marshmallows. Once your marshmallows have melted, add in your Rice Krispies and stir until it's all combined. I've really enjoyed this book as it's got pretty much a recipe for every occasion. It doesn't have a step-by-step -step picture to go with the recipe, but it does have an ending picture, so at least you know what it should look like. So you now want to put the marshmallow mixture into your pan, making sure to move quickly as it sets quick. Make sure to get every single bit around the bowl. We don't want to leave any behind. As it's a very sticky mixture, you might want to use some baking parchment to help push the mixture down as you don't want it sticking all on your hands. So I've now pushed down all of the mixture and I'm going to let that set on the side and cool down. To get all of the marshmallow mixture off of your pan, pop it back on the stove with some water in, take it to a boil and it will all come right off. For the icing, you want to sift in your cocoa powder and icing sugar into a bowl. I'm now just going to give that a little mix together. The recipe calls for one to two tablespoons of boiling water, so start with one and see how it goes from there. So it doesn't fly up all in my face, I'm going to give it a stir with a spoon first and then grab my electric mixer. In the end, I actually added around four to six tablespoons of water, so you may need to add some more as well. In the book, it states to use a silicon donut mold, but I'm just using a bump pan I already have. If yours won't come out, just use a knife to help you. So I'm gonna put it down backwards, and using the baking paper, I'm gonna form round edges. Using a spoon, you now want to drizzle over your icing. Just add it in small amounts as you can always add more, but you can never take out so. Before it dries, you then want to sprinkle on some sprinkles or add some sweets and decorate however you would like. If you don't want to use icing, you can always just melt some chocolate and pour that on top. So that's a super cute Rice Krispie Cake Donut ready for any occasion, easy. For more videos, subscribe to my channel. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and feel free to leave any requests in the comment box below.